Hey, what's up everybody? Danny Lightning back in. Today we're going to talk about how to play Android games like CSR2 or other games on your PC. Now, I don't know if you can get an iOS emulator, but there's quite a few different Android emulators that will let you... Basically, it turns your desktop into an Android device. And you can download all the games and all the apps right onto your PC. Now, I use something called Memu Play, M-E-M-U, which is kind of a weird name, but it's the best one that I've found. There's a lot of programs like BlueStacks and Knox, but I've tried all of these, and I seem to have a lot of problems with Knox and a lot of problems with BlueStacks, and there's a couple others as well, but Memu is the only one that just seems to work. Mimu, I know some of them have built-in screen recorders, some of them have, like, will let you set up a Xbox controller, but Mimu just works, alright? I don't, I don't know if you can do any of that on Mimu, but it works really well. Let's see what we have. Do we have a screen recorder on here? I'm not 100% sure. Screen recorder, yes. Mimu actually has a built-in screen recorder. That's not what I use. The only thing this is missing is the like Xbox controller support or the PlayStation controller support. Hopefully they add that in here sometime. But if you're looking to download this, all right, memuplay.com is where you get it. You just go up here and you click download. And this probably I don't know if this works on Apple or not. I don't know if this is a uh Windows only program. Looking through it, I'm sure if you look through the website, you'll be able to find out and see. But all right, version 6.3.7 is out now. Basically, just download Mimu Play onto your PC. You know, you do need a Google account, so you're gonna need a Gmail. You make a Gmail, you uh, you give it your Gmail and address and password, and it locks links you to the Google Play Store. So let's go back to the actual program itself. So basically, if you go on to Google Play, all right, I'm just going to click the Google Play app. It's going to pull up this. I mean, I can come on here. And I can search for all the different games and stuff. And I can install pretty much any game or app I want. You know, it's really easy, real simple. So that's pretty much the deal. I just install Mimu. I download Mimu on my computer, and anytime I want to play some Android games on there, I just run Mimu. Now, for screen recording, like I said, this does have a built in screen recorder, but I use something called OBS Studio. You can live stream to YouTube with this, which I don't know how to do yet. It seems kind of complicated. I gotta, I gotta figure that out, because I do get people requesting me to live stream. I'm not really sure what I would live stream about CSR2. Maybe, maybe fill up a couple tanks of gas and live stream some live races. I don't know. I try and make short, helpful videos for uh, CSR2, but one of these days I'm gonna figure out how to work this live stream, and I'll do something. Like I could always download, like live stream a couple War Robots games. Probably some live racing on on a uh, CSR2 or something. But this is here, I'll give you an actual look at it. This is the program I'm using right now. All I gotta do is hit this little button here that says start recording and it starts. And all I have to do is hit stop recording and it stops and it sends all my, uh, it sends the videos right to my folder called videos. Real simple, you know, I, it was really easy to set up my webcam. My laptop has a built-in webcam. Um, really easy to set up I mean there, there's so much stuff on this this program seems really really confusing when I downloaded this screen recorder I was completely lost at first I was like oh man this is crazy like but it then I kinda like went through it and I'm like oh this isn't so bad there's all kinds of stuff in here I don't even know what it is but it probably took me about uh, five minutes to actually set up to record video and I am pretty sure I have it set up now to live stream, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm going to have to test that here in the next couple of days. But yeah, I mean, it's pretty it's pretty easy, you know, just get it on here. You can open your game. Oh, I need to move this over here because we all know they love to... 
They love to give everybody our player ID now on CSR2, so I need to watch out where where my web. I need to make sure my webcam is covering that. So if you guys are playing CSR2 and if you're trying to record or anything, make sure you have something covering your player ID because you don't want to post videos to YouTube or anything else if your player ID is up there because somebody can steal your account. You know, when you guys join a crew, don't ever give anybody your player ID. I guess people can steal your account if they get your player ID. So, I mean, I think that pretty much sums this one up. I'm just going to hop on CSR2 real quick, see, see what's going on on there today. I ran through one race earlier that gave me some gold. So that was good, some extra gold. Can't complain too much about that. My computer's slow, though. It does take a while to load in sometimes. I'm playing on this 8-year-old gaming laptop. It's amazing this thing still works. I mean, 8 years, that's a long time for a laptop. Asus makes some awful off. I just said awful. Asus makes some awesome computer stuff, you know. They make really good parts, you know. They make their own stuff. They make their own motherboards. They're not putting those, like... 10, 10 cent Chinese motherboards in there. They put quality parts and all of their stuff. I really like their computers. That's one of the things in the computer you want to look for is a good processor, a good motherboard, and a decent amount of RAM. Those are really the three th major things. Good cooling system too. You want to make sure it gets good cooling because if your computer doesn't cool very well everything is going to get hot and wear out faster. This computer actually has an awesome cooling system. One of the best laptop cooling designs I have ever seen. But yeah, you, you need to make, make sure your case gets plenty of airflow. Man, this has taken a long time. It usually doesn't take this long to load in. I start up a video and you know how that goes. So today is the first day of the new season on CSR2. I was in second place with my like 2,000 points or something earlier. Alright, McLaren parts for free. I'm going to go ahead and collect those. But yeah, that's pretty much the deal. Just go ahead and download Mimu Play. You know, if you want to... If you want to uh, download that other thing the OBS studio you go to obsproject.com that's where you download it make sure you I don't download anything from third-party sites or anything like that I always make sure I get it directly from the makers website because too many of those places where you can go to download it from some other site have junk like malware or spyware or something added in so always be really careful where you're downloading your stuff from I wish I would have got some different rims on this car. I really do. I don't like those rims too much. This is an awesome car. I don't actually I don't like any of the rims on this car. They all look kind of weird. Like the the gold rims are really weird looking. These are I don't know. These are just I guess they're okay. I've kind of gotten used to them. I don't think there's really anything out on the map for me to do today. Crew Cup. Okay, we got a Crew Cup. I need to run through that really quick. That's just going to be three little races. And we've got Crew Tokens and Silver Keys. Alright? Three races. I need to do that. I need to collect that stuff. So let me do that really quick. The way these, these things work, they should just give you the stuff because... These are just so easy. Alright, I guess we're using the Volkswagen. I don't remember how to drive this car, so... That seems to work. Pretty sure you hit nitrous in second on this one. Maybe it's third though, I don't know. 
I have no idea. It's been I haven't driven this thing since it came out basically. Maybe once or twice after I've driven this. This is a nice car. I just don't drive the lower tier cars too often. But yeah, I mean, you can even find some videos on YouTube on how to uh, how to use that OBS Studio. Because it does a lot. That actually does a lot of stuff that I don't even understand. I have no idea what half the stuff on there is. But if you go through the menu, there's all kinds of junk in there. But it's definitely a good program. And it's free. OBS Studio is free. I forgot to mention that. It's not something you have to pay for. Mimu is also free. Which is awesome. It's amazing that some of these companies make these free programs. I mean, I don't know how they can just make something like that and not charge anything for it. I mean, I'm very grateful to the, to for them for doing that cuz you know, when you're running low on money and you most of these most of these programs people make are ridiculously expensive these days. And there's always these really nice free ones out there. I don't care what it is, you can almost always find a nice free version. Whether it's Photoshop or video editing or... There's always something out there for free that's really, really good. You just have to know where to download it from. Like I said, you always got to be careful where you download your stuff. Because you don't want to get your computer infected with a bunch of crap. I'm I'm even I I'm extremely careful about what websites I visit and everything else because I don't want any of that junk on my computer. All right, three races and I should have got some prizes here. Let's go back to my garage and see if they're ready. It's kind of weird the the crew cups and prize cups must not show up until they must not show up until like 7 a.m. my time. Because I was on at 6 a.m. and that wasn't there. It might have been like 5.30 a.m. So, sometimes I wake up and can't, can't, be, get, blah, 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 can't get back to sleep. Get on my line account. Say hello to my crew. Alright, let's see what else is on the map. I came back to my garage for a reason, but I can't... Oh, yeah. I wanted to see if my crew cup points were ready, but they're not. Those come in your rewards after, like... I think your crew has to win a total of, like, 50 races. And then you guys can collect all those prizes. So you do gotta be in a crew for some of these things to work. Um, is there anything else I feel like I need to do right away on here? I've only got three things of gas left. Let's see. So far, we've oh, we've only had ten races won. We have to win fifty, and then we can collect those prizes. Legends trials. What's on the legends board today? It looks like I can use any legends car I want, so I'm gonna go ahead and. Well, I guess I can only use the boss Mustang. I'm going to go ahead and run through a couple of these Legends races. I hardly ever do that. My uh, Shelby my Shelby is almost restored, finally. I've only got like three Legends cars restored. I'm slacking. I am slacking on Legends because I really don't care too much about it. I 
don't really like this car. I'm not a big fan. Most of my Legends cars aren't really upgraded and they don't have many parts installed. I really just don't want a bunch of want to spend a whole bunch of game cash cuz it takes for it takes forever to save that game cash up. And like next ne I guess I should say this season we've got the I think that Expo which I believe is a that's a tier 5 car, isn't it? So we got that for the Prestige Cup. That's going to be expensive to upgrade. That's going to be around 6 million. I can't remember what the gold or evil cup is going to be. I'm trying to remember. I know I, I know I made a video about it, but I have forgotten. It's too early in the morning. I can tell you that much. So yeah, at this point, I'm just kind of babbling on, but this OBS Studio works really well. I like this. Mimu works really well. I mean, that's one of those are the two things I'm currently using at the moment to make this video. Then when I'm done, I'll just go ahead and upload that to YouTube. I think I hit my nitrous in the wrong gear, and I think I lost. Yep, I sure did. I think I hit my nitrous in second gear instead of third, and it got me. I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. That's why it's important to know which gear to hit your nitrous on. Alright, so I'm out of gas. I'm going to close this down and I'm going to open up my War Robots game and see if there's any junk on there I can collect today. Alright, so let's go back to my garage and shut this game down properly. Sometimes if you just close it without shutting it down the way it's made to be shut down, your timers will stop. And when you get back on in like three hours, you don't have any gas still because... It, the game incorrectly shut down and stopped your timer so I always make sure I hit the little back button and hit quit and that almost always shuts the d game down properly <laughs> oh man alright let's see what's on war robots today today's what Monday Thir today's Thursday I keep thinking it's Monday. I don't know what's going on. I'm out of it this morning. I wish my computer wasn't so old and slow. I'll tell you that. This thing used to fly back when it was new. When I have a GTX 670 graphics card, 8 gigs of byte, 8 gigabytes of RAM. Nowadays, 8, 8 gigs is like the bare minimum, but when this 8 gigs was pretty good back when uh, when I got this thing. Windows 10 came out, and I guess you need at least about 8 gigs of RAM for that. Hey, I leveled up somehow, and I didn't even do anything. That's interesting. Alright, is there anything I can collect in here? Doesn't look like it. Usually when this levels up, there's something you can collect, but... There's nothing there. Maybe that was a weird glitch. Oh, let's see what they're selling today. Two Hydras for nine bucks. That's a good deal, I guess, if you like Hydras. Some junk for two dollars and fifty cents. Every once in a while, if there's a really good, like, Sometimes you'll find a robot on sale for like a dollar or like five dollars. Every once in a while I might buy something on here when they have it on sale. Most of the time the prices are ridiculous. You know, they want between 50 and 100 bucks for a weapon or a robot. Ah, that's crazy. And then you got to spend weeks or months leveling the thing up. It looks like there's nothing for me to collect right now. I've been playing around with different weapons on this guy. So 
So right now he's upgrading to level 11. I might I might actually mark to this guy because he's old economy and he's really inexpensive to level up. All my other my Lancelot's pretty inexpensive to level up too, I think. A lot of these a lot of my robots are old economy, so they're they're cheaper. You know, what some new company bought this game and they raised all the prices on like how much silver and gold stuff cost to level up or buy or whatever and uh they they made the times a lot longer for upgrade times. But one thing that's nice is like if you had if you already had a robot, you know, it, it kept the old times. Only the new stuff that you get has the long times and whatnot. So at least they did that, which is cool. Ah, oh, we got a skirmish up. Let's go play the skirmish and see what it is. The skirmish is just like a random, it's not your hanger of robots, they just give you a random hanger to play with. And sometimes it's not even like the actual robot, sometimes they completely change everything. Once they had this really, really awesome set of, of uh, hovers that flew, they would just zoom across the whole map, it was like, they w it was crazy. I mean, that was the most fun skirmish I had ever seen. I guess I'm going to start with the Fenrir. I still don't know if I pronounced these guys' names correctly or not, but... Let's come over here and zap this guy. You know, I was, I was thinking maybe I should replace... Maybe I should replace my Lancelot with one of these, but I like my Lancelot. I don't think this robot's really that good. Like, it is, but it isn't. Can't seem to hit anybody. I think this robot was meant to replace the Lancelot, but it just it just it just can't replace Lancelot. I don't know what's shooting me, but let's come through here and try and take this guy out. He's got some sort of ability that's allowing him to sur survive a little bit. See, they're all, they're all just hiding back here next to their healers. So this is one of those camper teams that we're dealing with, so... I guess we might as well just rush in here and take these guys out. And I have been locked down. Kill. Looks like there must be somebody behind us. There's a whole bunch of healers over here, so I'm just gonna run in and try and kill all these healers. Let me go after this guy first. These are the ones that can harm us, so... I'm gonna go ahead and use my healing ability. Took that guy out. This robot is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I thought he would be a little more tanky than he actually is though. Let's take this one down. Use my healing thing again. Alright, those guys took me out, so I'm going to go ahead and come in with... Man, all these are going to be really... I guess I'll try the Bulwark. I don't really like this lineup of robots they have up here today. 
This bulwark's moving pretty fast. I don't know if they buffed his movement speed or if that's just how they made him for the skirmish. Because like I said, sometimes they change the robots around. Sometimes they're actually a lot better on the skirmish than they are if you actually get the robot. got me. I guess I'll bring my Lancelot in. Turn on those turbo boosters so he moves a little faster because I'll tell you what, he is pretty slow. death mark this guy so I do more damage to him and I'm getting burned up by those things for some reason I don't know what just happened there that was weird It's like I put I had that one ability on that I didn't realize that I had. This guy is so slow. That was some lag. Such a slow robot. Some of my weapons are still hitting that guy. How did I kill him? Let's try and take this guy out. I think he's going to get me here. I need to try and move. Oh man, I'm dead. Well, all I got left is a Wayland with shotguns. Wait, those aren't shotguns. Those are uh, these horrible things. I've never actually used this particular weapon. At least not the heavy version of this weapon. They used to have a really long reload time. He's coming over here. Oh no, that's going to kill me for sure. He can't lock on. I'm going to go up into healing mode so I can try and heal myself a little bit. So 
that guy will kill me. Let's see if I can. I know I'm about to die here. These are not the right weapons for the Wheeland, I'll tell you that. So now he can't lock on. That's actually a pretty nice ability for something like this where people can't hit you. I can't get him. I don't know if this guy needs healing or not. It doesn't look like it. Alright, and our team won. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video because this video is really just a bunch of nonsense and me babbling around except for the first couple minutes. Yay, whaling components that I don't need. Spark components. I like the spark, so I don't really need another spark, but anyways... Okay, let's go collect this junk real quick. I'm gonna claim that stuff, and I got got what four million? Is that four million? I don't know. Something like that. All right, catch you guys later.